Dr. Phil recently weighed in on the admission scandal, and a local school was not happy with what he said. He said that many of the parents tried to get their kids into top schools for bragging rights. Yeah, and then he said that none of those parents want to be the one that says, well, yeah, my kid's going to Slippery Rock. Well, he has since apologized, saying he didn't realize Slippery Rock was a real university. Which, of course, it is. We spoke with the president of Slippery Rock today. Ralph Iannotti has his reaction. In a lot of ways, I'm grateful to Dr. Phil because he allowed us to shine a spotlight on the good work that we're doing. Slippery Rock University president Dr. William Berry turning what could have been seen as a slam on the school into something positive. He was making a point, uh, and and he he picked Slippery Rock. I imagine because we have a very unique name, and and so so he made a point that we're not that sort of school, and and in truth, he's right. We're, we're not that sort of school. We don't cater ourselves to 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 sort of this image of being elite uh, and elitist. Dr. Phil, the TV psychologist, made the comments about Slippery Rock during an interview with People magazine concerning the college admission scandal. Barry responded saying, we suspect you didn't mean that as a compliment, but we take it as one anyway. We're very proud of um, what we do. Roughly a third of our students get significant federal financial aid. About a third of our students are first generation um, in their family to go to college. Pennsylvania has 14 state-owned colleges and universities, and Barry says they all cater to the children of people who work for a living. If you're just chasing brand and you're not thinking about what's the best education for you, it's a mistake, and it's a terrible mistake. Dr. Phil says he has since educated himself about Slippery Rock and could not be more impressed. He added that his comment was not intention. Barry says he holds no animosity towards Dr. Phil. He was good natured about it. He made an observation. We pushed back and said, hey, think about this again. He thought about it again. I consider us good friends. And he says Slippery Rock will continue providing an affordable quality education. The best school to go to is the one that's going to see you through to graduation and give you a launch pad for your life. Ralph Iannotti, KDKA News.